Chief Executive Carrie Lam arrived in Zurich, Switzerland on Monday and first met Mayor of Zurich, Corinne Moch. Mrs. Lam said Switzerland and Hong Kong have always enjoyed close trade ties, adding that as both Hong Kong and Zurich are international financial centers, they could learn from each other. She also expressed hope that collaboration in finance, innovation and technology, design and smart city, as well as in exchanges between young people of both cities could be enhanced. Mrs. Lam then joined a lunch meeting organized by the Swiss Bankers Association. During the meeting, they exchanged views on financial technology, private wealth management, the opening up of the mainland financial markets and the Belt and Road Initiative. The chief executive then headed to Davos, where she attended an entrepreneur dinner on artificial intelligence. Addressing the representatives of innovation and technology enterprises, Mrs. Lam noted the Hong Kong Special Administrative Region government is keen to advance INT development, including the establishment of two world-class research clusters specializing in healthcare technologies and artificial intelligence and robotics at the Hong Kong Science Park. She added that she would welcome Swiss INT enterprises to come and make use of the two research clusters and collaborate with Hong Kong to jointly shape the future of artificial intelligence and technology. Mrs. Lam continued her visit to Davos on Tuesday, where she met President of the National Academy of Medicine of the United States, Dr. Victor Zhao, to keep abreast of the latest developments in U.S. healthcare technologies. She also called on President of the New York Stock Exchange, Stacey Cunningham, and exchanged views on the latest developments in the securities industry and explored ideas for cooperation. Mrs. Lam noted that as Hong Kong strives to attract more overseas enterprises to list in the city and provides a fundraising platform for new economy companies, she hoped Hong Kong and New York would enhance exchanges and collaboration in relevant aspects.